everybody hope you're doing well uh so basically twitter has made a special account that's dedicated to detecting and reporting misinformation on their website on paper it's a great idea wait no no it isn't and do you know why take a guess a uh, a wild guess as to why it is a terrible idea a because it's community driven or b don't even bother with b because you already know it's fucking a for example, if I were to say, Dream fakes all of his videos, including his speedruns, a massive army of Dream stands could just band together, report my tweet, and get it taken down. I won't show the video they played to demonstrate this new system, but they brand it as giving the tweet context, instead of correctly as reporting a tweet for misinformation. I'll link the video demonstrating this in the description, and I'll put it in the card so you can watch it. But the thing is, with this new system, it's completely stupid, because anyone can do anything. So it just completely is out of Twitter's control. It's just really dumb. Ever since Pegasus called out Twitter for not taking action when child was posted on their platform, they didn't take any action because it didn't, quote, violate their community guidelines. See, now that's some bullshit. They essentially came up with a half-assed attempt to prevent shit like this from spreading. Uh, but instead of buckling down and taking care of misleading, inappropriate, and borderline illegal information personally, what they end up doing is boiling the entire thing down to the bullshit YouTube copyright system. The situation is almost exactly the same. Anyone can decide they don't like your tweet and can report it for anything, even if it's in direct compliance with the community guidelines, and you're pretty much powerless to stop it. Twitter needs to handle this privately instead of, the, instead of sicking the public on whatever they like or don't like. Take care of your fucking website and stop having other people do it for you. That's about it. Subscribe.